So we just completed six nights in a beautiful city east of Nice called Villefranche-sur-Mer, which is a little bay that's uh, historically Italian. So, and we were right in the old part of this little community and it was so ideal, it was it, very charming. It's tiny, a little, basically a beach, a train station, a market and a couple of shops and some houses. But uh, it's kind of right in the middle in between Monaco and Nice. So it was a perfect little spot for us to slow down and to enjoy a lot of beach time. Yes, the, there's a sandy beach and there's some more rockier beaches. But uh, we went on the Mediterranean Sea every day, even though it's a little refreshing, but it's super salty and buoyant and it was just amazing. We had beautiful weather, it was super hot out, like high 20s every day. We got lots of gelato, we had a great apartment. It was a wonderful space for us. We had everything we needed. And we were just on this little pedestrian only street right above a little restaurant. And we had a little tiny view of the ocean and it was actually just perfect for us. So one of our little adventures is we did go to the market one morning, bought all the produce, a little fresh chicken, and it was amazing. We got hit by a moped in so, like just, right in, right in between us, kind of just lightly grazed our elbows, but and we, knocked us over. We didn't get too hurt, and no. it was fine. She was really worried about us, but we were okay. But it was the postal worker going postal, but she lost control of her moped, and it was quite the. The scene we caused. <laughs> and based on the number of times we've been near misses with mopeds on our trip, it was bound to happen at some point. One of the other great adventures that we did when we were just walking around the bay exploring is we happened upon the Rothschilds Garden, which is this old estate on the left hand side of the bay. And it happened to be the Fête de Roses when we were there. And it was a beautiful day and a very interesting experience. So we didn't realize that we were completely underdressed. Everybody was in their Sunday best. The mayor was there. And there was all these different little exhibits, like a harpist playing in the garden in one place. We have walk around a corner and there's velour pillows on the ground. And there's women reading and a man reading poetry and fables about roses and flowers. It was amazing and they dedicated a new rose that they had bred to an old gardener that was retiring and they christened it with champagne and they released the doves and uh, followed up with a little ballet demonstration while we were there. So we definitely enjoyed that and it was serendipity to find it. We didn't know anything about it that it was going on and we got really lucky. So we enjoyed that experience and we've learned that sometimes we have the best experiences when you don't plan anything and you just go exploring. We also took the train east to Monaco for the day and it had been just after they finished the uh, historical Grand Prix with all the old cars. So there was stands set up everywhere but they were taking them all down and everything. The big party had just happened but we still explored the bay. We got and walked up onto the hill and saw the palace. So we went to the casinos. Unfortunately I didn't have uh, my ID which we were permitted to go in so we were at Monte Carlo and all that. There is like the Ferraris and the Bugattis parked outside, very and, opulent. And the bay is full of just mega yachts, very expensive, very large yachts. All the, all the wealthy people that came for the race were just starting to leave and head out on their helicopters and their yachts and things. No but, celebrity sightings. <laughs> we also went to Nice for the day, took the bus around the bay. Uh, it's just the next bay over. We did a little shopping, we had a nice meal. We walked the, uh, the Grand Boulevard at the front of the beach there. We had some really nice conversations with some locals. Mm -hmm. uh, we enjoyed some more beach time and we had a nice meal while we were there. So that was a really fun day too. Nice is uh, it's very beautiful and quite nice, but we definitely appreciated the slower pace and the smaller Villefranche a lot more. Yeah. great time. Now we've left. We're currently in Nîmes, France, where we're here for the next week or so. Uh, we're inland and we're going to be exploring a lot of Roman ruins and, yeah. uh, and fun stuff like that. So stay tuned for the next video. Okay. Au revoir. Au revoir.